normally when you have a prosthetic like this, you pre-paint it. But in this case, we try it and I don't know why it doesn't work because it's like a kind of messy <laughs> makeup, no, with a lot of colors. We have to make it like uh, in, in layers. We cannot put all the colors on, here, on, on, on top. And it, it's what it takes time. We approached uh, DDT for the prosthetic effects because I trust them completely from Devil's Backbone, Pan's Labyrinth, Hellboy, and so forth. And we knew they were going to be able to interpret Andy's ideas for Mama. DDT were great because they really made a, a beautiful translation from my 2D sketches to a real sculpture. We didn't want any um, seam. So normally you make a mold like with different parts, like a puzzle. From this, we go from center uh, outside and then we end with the back. It's quite difficult and then you have the edges that also, you know, I mean, you have very good edges, so you want to keep it and you want to glue it. And this is what it really takes longer to, to do because it's like a, yeah. uh, a clock uh, kind of work. You have to be very meticulous and we get really tense when we do that.